What's up everybody? I am Jazzy Denise. Welcome back to the channel today. Alright guys, I'm jumping right into it. It's moving day today. We are packing. The movers are here and we are getting out. I was supposed to start this vlog earlier today, but unfortunately, this is where we're at. Everything is in boxes. Everything is in bags, except for my little wiggy over here because that's getting put on later tonight. <laughs> and everything's clean. So, let's just see where we are right now. Duty room is all broken down. Everything is all packed up. Knocking stuff over. We took the bed down. It's actually not a bad day temperature-wise today, so... Hopefully we can get this done quick, fast, in a hurry. We have a lot of things getting dropped off at the new place. So the faster we can get everything out of here and over there, the better it'll be. We hired two men and one truck to come move everything for us. Bates coming with more shoes. For this truck, it was 169. Let me help Bates. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did I put those in there okay? I'm just trying to keep savoring. Y'all, this is going way faster than expected. Like, they are getting ish cleaned, okay? Like, my entire living room, this whole room, is pretty much cleaned out. You couldn't even walk in this room a minute ago. And it's, it's only been like 10 minutes, so... Movers was definitely the right route to take. So all of this living room furniture right here is going to go in our basement. We actually got a new sectional that is being delivered today. And we got a dining room table, but that can't get here till June due to the fact that it was on back order. But all in all, focus on that later. Right now we're focusing on getting this place cleaned out. All right, y'all. So at this point, we are about 70% of the way done. Wow, you can hear my voice echoing in this room now. <laughs> but this room is completely clean. We've taken the lights out. All we really have to get done now is the big pieces of furniture. And everything will be moved out. No wonder he was back here sweating crazy. I was wondering why he was making so much noise. They wrapped this stuff up real good. I like that. No dents, no scrapes, no bruises. This is actually like our entire bed frame. So when we broke the bed down, when we bought the bed originally, I think we got it off of Amazon or maybe Wayfair, I'm not sure. But when we got it, the entire bed came. <laughs> inside of the headboard so pretty much it's all in here unzip this and the entire frame comes out and it's so easy to put together i recommend these type of beds for anybody that's like living by themselves that don't know how to be a handyman <laughs> i'm so tired could be due to the fact that Oh, this room's completely clean now. Could be due to the fact that I went to sleep at like 2.30 last night. Look at that pink hair all on the floor <laughs> from doing my watercolor videos. I went to sleep at 2.30 last night. Woke up at 6 to get my car in the shop. Beauty's over there. I am personally chauffeuring her to the new place. She's so pretty. Let me see she has like the blonde patch in the front. I did the little patchy patch just because I was like YOLO. All right, we are off in the car. Everything is packed up. We're moving on to the new place. The best Buy people giving me anxiety. Cause they keep trying to deliver our stuff early. They told us 12 and two, it's 11.25 and they called an hour ago. We weren't prepared for that. We gotta go get the keys. And we will meet the moving people at the new place. Okay. Um, the couch, that chair, and uh, the TV stand. Oh. And I guess you can put the bigger TV downstairs as well. Okay. Um, the bench can also, that weight bench Wait. can also go downstairs. Um, there's a, like, a, a, back, a back door. Guys, we are in the new place. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, we are in the new place. It is so spacious. I am in absolute love. <laughs> I'm gonna give you guys a house tour. I can't do an empty house tour because we are literally moving in today and the movers are here to move everything in. So, two bathroom, three bedroom, 
Um, it's a two bathroom, three bedroom townhome with three floors. So we also have a basement. The bathroom on the first floor has a stand in shower, and the one upstairs where our room is is a full tub and everything. Okay, guys, I know I'm a bit out of frame, but I figured I'd talk to you guys while I hook up our cable and stuff with our internet and stuff. So they're gonna go ahead and unpack and then they're unloading, and I'm going to do the womanly duties and <laughs> start hooking stuff up. This is such a nice place, like, I'm really excited. Sorry guys, I had to go ahead and set up a camera stand because I just didn't like that angle that I was on at first. But we are literally like right up the street from where we just were previously. Um, but this is such a much better location. From what we can see, we haven't really lived here yet, so we don't really know. But all in all, it's bigger, way bigger more room for us to be able to set it up how we want to. Like, I feel like all of our other apartments before this one were kind of childish. I guess the real downstairs? Okay. Yes, please, yes, downstairs is fine. I meant to show you guys this earlier when I was actually packing up, but this is a little trick I actually learned from, I think Raven Elise when she was moving, put plastic bags over your clothes when you're moving them from one place to another. So that way you can still keep them on the hangers and you keep them covered from the elements. And when you get to your new place, you just rip it off. <laughs> but I can't do it with one hand. <laughs> rip it off. Of course, when I try to film it, it goes haywire, but rip it off. Now you got your access plastic bag and your clothes are on hangers in the closet where they should be. Okay, you guys, we are officially done. The movers have left. The washing machine and dryer is installed. All we are waiting on at this point is our sectional to come today and we are done moving today. It is currently around like, I don't know, two o'clock. So we started this process of moving around 9 a.m. Finished at 1.30ish. And we really started our day off at 6 a.m. by going to the car dealership. One thing that I'm actually really excited about that we got is this overly complicated Ninja Blender. Okay, when I tell you this thing is complicated, I can't even get the dang on lid on here. Like every time I try to close it, it pops right back out. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but I'm really gonna sit down and watch some videos on how to use this blender because I can't wait to make a smoothie with it. All right, y'all, it is currently, shoot, I don't know. I don't got my phone, I don't got a watch on me. I have no idea what time it is, but it's late. It's like quitting time for my work day if I was at work, all in all. We are officially done with the move for today, and now it's just a matter of getting everything set up. Right now, we are having couch problems, guys. Like, oh my god, we bought this six-piece reclining sectional, and it is our perfect dream couch that we wanted. Everything that we liked is a part of it. It reclines. It's all electronic. It has USB cords and everything, but it's huge. So we are struggling with how we are going to place it. We moved it twice already, so we're going to move it again when we get back. But we need an intermission for food and for groceries and just some miscellaneous objects, items that's needed for the house right now. And I'm tired. My body's tired. All right, we've made it to this Mexican restaurant called El Magues. That's out around the way. And funny thing, Anthony says my mood changed as soon as <laughs> food and drinks was presented to me. 
Yeah. I dropped the couch on my foot earlier. So my foot like, hurts. Maybe it'll be okay. Right now, I'm looking forward to this margarita. It came! The food has come and <laughs> let's try this again. <laughs> okay, the food has arrived and we are eating. I got a chimichanga and a tamale and babe got chicken nachos. So yeah, we digging in. Smile, you're on candy camera. Anything you wanna say to your fans? <laughs> Well, fine. They said F you too. Alright, y'all. So, it's actually like the next day. <laughs> I didn't record anymore after we left the restaurant because we were too busy setting everything up that we had to set up from delivery and whatnot. And now I am currently just taking down my hair because I'm about to wash it. It's been two days worth of a crazy move. Things started going crazy. First, our internet was... It was working perfectly fine when we first got here. So I set it up. You guys saw me setting it up. Everything lit up perfectly. It was fine. It was great. And then, I don't know where we're watching the Golden State and Houston game six. And literally, it's probably about four minutes and 15 seconds left in the freaking game. We're in the fourth quarter at this point. And the internet just completely stops working. It just completely shut off. We keep trying to reconnect it, nothing's happening. And then finally, it takes me to this, when I connected my phone to it, it was like, hey, you need to activate the internet. Go ahead and put in the information so you can activate it. Now, mind you, at this point, it's like 1030. So I'm like, okay, well, let me go ahead and just activate the internet. And I put in the information it asked for, and then I click the next button. And it just says error. It says error, sorry, you need to call. Well, I wasn't going to spend all night online with customer service trying to call if they would have even answered on a Friday night. So, I decided to just be mad all night. I, was, I had a little attitude because the internet was out, but it, it is what it is. Me and Babe just decided to chill out, have a couple of drinks, and just enjoy each other's company in our new environment. So, that's how we ended the night. Alright, y'all. My bad. Um, I had to delete some stuff because my memory was full, but all in all, I was just saying I was coming on here to just speak with you guys and give you an update before I ended the initial move in vlog, and I decided to do it while I'm taking my hair down. So, pretty much, I'm just about to deep condition my hair before I wash it, and I'm not recording it, but you guys, if you want to see a video on that, go ahead and let me know below, leave some likes, leave some suggestions, leave some comments, just anything, and I will definitely record that for you guys. I'm not opposed to doing natural hair videos. I started out doing natural hair videos. I'm doing weave now because of all the promotion I'm doing for my upcoming company, which, stay tuned, that's coming really soon, guys, really soon. And this hair that I'm actually about to install is a sample from the company. I'm trying to decide if I want to launch with this hair texture or not. So once you guys see it, please let me know again. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Let me know. Oh. And oh no, we did get the internet fixed. I don't think I said that earlier, but we did get the internet fixed. It is working properly. Babe called and got it. It's re got the signal resent to the router and the modem today. And it's been working fine ever since. And you guys, I didn't even tell you, I lost my camera cap, the cap that covers the lens on my camera. I left it at the restaurant yesterday on the table. I had misplaced my camera charger, so I had to go on a mission to try to find my camera charger, which I finally found. I had to actually go back through the clips from yesterday and look to see that my charger was still in the wall, and I had to 
try to figure out where it could have been put at that point with the <laughs> the image of the things I saw in the background like the bags and boxes I saw in the background and I saw one of my hair bands in the closet and I went straight to it and lo and behold it was in there but now I am missing my connector piece that goes on the base of my camera and connects it to my tripod because originally it was on my camera when I first started recording but I took it out and I set it down somewhere and I don't know where I set it. Alright y'all so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this vlog. I'm just gonna finish my hair and probably chill out for the rest of the night. Me and babe are doing this pizza making date night situation just trying to do something different we've never made pizza ever in our lives so this will be fun but that's it so until the next video you guys please be you be beautiful can't wait to see you in the next one don't forget to like comment and subscribe to jazzy denise tv and i will see you guys later bye